Hi guys, my name is Johan from Restoration.bike and in this video I'm going to delve into determining the correct chain ring compatibility with your crank. If you know what to look for, this is a piece of cake and if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel which is always appreciated. So let's get started. In my case, I decided to swap out the existing Dior XT crank set for a Koda Tarantula crank set for, for my 1994 Cannondale Super V. The Dior XT crank set is a triple with a 22, 32, 40 T ch chain rings. The Koda Tarantula, however, is a dual 29, 44 setup. Normally, I would replace the entire crank since buying new parts is usually more expensive than buying an entire used crank set. However, since the Coda crank sets are pretty rare and expensive, this time I decided to swap out this failing chain ring. Not all crank sets have replaceable chain rings. Some low tier cranks have the chain rings riveted in place. If the crank has chain ring bolts, it means the chain rings can be replaced. Most older style triple crank sets have a five bolt setup. And one of the easiest ways to determine which chain ring is going to be compatible with your crank is to simply type in your brand, group set, and type and add it with chain ring and possibly the amount of teeth you want. You can find the type of the crank located at the back of it. If you can't find the same type chain ring because of its rarity, or you're unwilling to spend the type of money being charged for new old stock parts, you'll need to know the chain ring compatibility with your crank. And you can do that by measuring the bolt to bolt length and use that metric in combination with the number of bolts necessary to tighten the chain ring to determine the bolt circle diameter. In my case, with a bolt to bolt length of 55.4 millimeters and five mounting points, the bolt circle diameter or BCD for my chain rings needed to be 94 millimeters. So that's how you determine what type of chain ring will be compatible with your crank set. I hope you liked watching the video and I hope I can welcome you again for the next one. Bye for now.